Shout out to Big L, Children of the Corn, huh? I mean, just hip hop. You know, this is the epitome of hip hop. Back in the week, we go to the hall, 139, you see him right in front of the crowd, check his phone. Get a cipher with him. You know what I mean? He was real hip hop. Shout out to Big and the Cricks, too. I used to see L all the time in Hall. Like, we was, we was coming up. He was one of the first young dudes to get a record deal and get in. So, one, two. we all looked up to him. I ain't check it out. Yo, fuck all the glamours and glitz. I plan to get rich. I'm from New York and never was abandoned in Knicks. And I'm all about expanding my chips. You mad cause I was in the van with your bitch. With both hands on the tits. Hold me on, hold the phone. That you know in your heart. I got style. Plus the way that I be flowing is sharp. A while back, I used to hustle, selling flow in the park. Counting cheese stacks and rocking lights that glow in the dark. Forever, hotty hunting, trigger temper. I'm quick to body something. You looking at me like a rally frontin'. I fuck around and throw three in your chest. Bleed in my best, I'm older and smarter. This is me and my best. I stop hanging around, y'all. Cause niggas like you be praying on my downfall. Hoping I block, hoping I stop. You probably even hope I get locked. Or be on the street corner with a pipe, smoking the rock. I got more bitches than you, fuck more bitches than you. Only thing I haven't got is more stitches than you. Fucking punk, you ain't a leader, what? Nobody followed you. It was never shit. Your mother should have swallowed you. You want some tag along, funky yes man shit. Do me a favor, please get off the next man pick. And if you think I can't fuck with whoever, put your money up. Put your jewels up, no fuck it, put your honey up. Put your bag in the house up, nigga. Or shut your mouth up before I bump that and make a lot of bloodshed. Turn your tucks red, the fuck you broke, got enough bread. And mad moves, ask Beavis, I can nothing but head. My game is vicious and cruel, looking chicks is a fool. If my girl think I'm going to use, then that bitch is a fool. How come you can listen to my first album and tell where a lot of niggas got their whole style from? Yeah. So what you acting for? You ain't half as raw. You need to practice more. Somebody tell this nigga something before I crack it, George. You I'm a boy, 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 I'm a and then, you know, Big Al was my little brother, so, like, what people didn't really know is that he looked to me for mentorship, and he would always come to me and be like, yo, bro, what's up? And, you know, I always tell a story that when we, we recorded the song, The Enemy, Primo did the beat, we was in d and Big Al was like, yo, man, you ain't gold. I'ma rip you down on this fucking song right here, man. I'm taking your half a million fans, nigga. I'ma kill you on this song. I'm like, yo, this nigga Al is fucking crazy, man. He was a big gambler. You know, Big Al would gamble all the time. And, you know, he would fight niggas, like big niggas. I'd be like, yo, Al, could we just go shoot the block up? You're like, nah, I grew up with these niggas. Just come stand by me, I'ma fight. Every time I went to Harlem and see Big Al that he was gonna fight, he thought he would fight a nigga your size, like the biggest nigga in the world. He's like this. Fuck that. I'm like, oh my God. Like, yo, El, can we jump this nigga, man? Can we fucking hit him with a bat? Nah, nah, no. You know, he was a fan square dude. Big El was a fan square dude. He'll fight the biggest nigga in the world, man. It's crazy.